What's going on everybody? Today I wanted to show you how to use the Google Maps API for JavaScript with LabVIEW. So I'm going to show you how you can send the uh, coordinates from the Google Maps API to LabVIEW. So what I have here is this map that I created using HTML and I can click anywhere on the map it works just like any uh, just like your regular Google Maps interface so I can click on any place in the map and whenever I click the send button notice how my coordinates on this lab view VI are going to change so that changed to whatever value I have here let me do that again so you can see it and of course you can zoom in and out of the map so that's what I'm going to show you how to make I'm gonna be posting the uh, links to the files and to the code in, in uh, the description below this video or if you're watching this on my website allaboutee.com then you can just scroll below and you will see all the code there and uh, the links to the VI and everything so I'm gonna stop my LabVIEW application so let's talk about the uh, map interface first like I said this is this was developed in HTML if we look at the code you know I have some CSS uh, so a some a button for my HTML and uh, so don't worry about all this code. I just wanted to show you what uh, what it was about. Uh, I will post it on my website, like I said. So this is basically my Google Maps code that I uh, that I wrote, and I'm using jQuery, which is a uh, very popular JavaScript library. But uh, the way the communication happens between my map and my LabVIEW VI is through a language called PHP so this is a PHP script that I wrote it runs on a PHP server or uh, rather an Apache server so what I'm doing is uh, from this file which is uh, this program here every time I click on the button I send the coordinates to my GPS coordinate receiver script so this is where I receive my latitude this is where I receive my longitude and then I simply write them to this text file respectively and from my VI all I'm doing is I'm reading the uh, I'm using the read file block so I just give it the file and I have an error block in case there's an error while reading the file or while trying to open it or whatever and then I just show the text and that's uh, what you see here so you can do a lot of uh, cool things with this the thing that I'm working on and actually I have it uh, ready already is I'm sending the coordinates to an Arduino and that Arduino has a GPS sensor with it and so I'm comparing the values that I'm sending from LabVIEW to the Arduino and then my robot is gonna know when it gets to that place that I told it to go so that's one way you can implement uh, your Google Maps API with your uh, LabVIEW programs and one last thing is that uh, before you try to run any of this code you are gonna have to get your own API key for uh, Google Maps from Google and it's free so don't worry about it I'll, I'll post this link also in my website and uh, the video description and I'll post any other programs that you have to download also in the description or my website so thank you for watching